I think every time you take the floor, no matter who's available, if you're a good team, then you have a chance. Another dominant second half performance by the Philadelphia 76ers proved to be too much for the Boston Celtics. The Seas were looking for their shot at redemption following Wednesday's matchup and held the lead heading into halftime. However, Philly put their foot on the gas to close out with the 122 to 110 victory despite Jalen Brown logging a career high with 42 points. And post game, the team said it bluntly that they just need to be better. We have to be more detail oriented. Everything has to be crisper. Everything has to be tighter. Everything has to be done to perfection, even more so when the other team is is locked in. Too, uh, too haphazard, in my opinion. I give credit to Philadelphia. They, they made some big plays down the stretch, but two, two very winnable games for us. And uh, like I said previously, I can do more, I will do more. We just have to be better as a group, executing, you know, sharing the basketball, making the right play, being in the right positions. You know, we're, not, we're just not doing it consistently. That's what's, that's what's hurting us. Peyton Pritchard had to leave the game and was later diagnosed with a right knee sprain. In postgame, Brad Stevens said that he didn't have any further updates on the injury. He assumed that there would be some kind of testing taking place tomorrow, though. But we'll make sure to provide updates on that as they come.